welcome to the channel guys if you saw that thumbnail then let's jump right in on it what are we talking about today guys do you like all of the things do you like all of the things just for you okay now you might be looking at this like girl what are you talking about with all of the different videos that I have recently been making. If you have not seen those, please feel free to go check it out. I have a video talking about this is a bull-ish, okay? <laughs> um, I have another video out um, talking about what? Um, how we are easily influenced um, with all of the things. So guys, with that being said, do you ever just stop? Like, guys, I can use for a pure example. These things that I put here on my wall, this futon, I thoroughly, and do you thoroughly enjoy and like the things that you purchase for yourself? And I've got to say, ding, 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 I love I love, I like my things. And is there something wrong with that? Like, is there something wrong with that? Is there some, you know, police out here that, that are going to get me because I work hard every day dealing with what I do, deal with in my life for my job? Um... You know, and I, don't get me wrong. I love my job. I love what I do. But there are days where those people get on my ever-loving last nerve. I would be the first one to say it. Guys, you can say it in the comments. You know, I don't know where you work. I don't know who you work for. I don't know what you do. I don't know if you have a job. I don't know if you have a career. But it is days that they get on my nerves. But it is days that I am so grateful that I have a place of employment, um, you know, that I've been there for a, a substantial amount of time and that I've chose to work in the field that I work in. Okay. So with that being said, there is good and bad and ugly with all of the things, right? So do you really like, do you really like the things that you have for you. If you see my other videos and different things, guys, I'm looking around because I'm trying to find, I'm trying to find some things, okay? Like when I purchased this bag, if you are familiar with your girl's channel, now this doesn't match what I have going on. I just literally picked up something, okay? But when I sat down and I ordered this bag, it's because I found this bag to be utterly adorable. If you have been watching my videos and my content, guys, you will know. Your girl being me, I am in this stage in my life where I am thoroughly loving these um, mini bags. Like, I love a good big bag. Do not ever misunderstand me do not ever misunderstand me now this this isn't she isn't the biggest um girl but i love a bigger bag i am here for a bigger bag every day all of the time but guys i love and I feel like there is absolutely nothing wrong. And guys, I have her bigger bag and I'm really looking at it. But I don't want to get up inside of this video. But I, I bought this bag from... Where did I buy this bag from, guys? Burlington. Right? I When I, when I saw it, I was like, she cute. She's going to do what I need her to do. Guys, I have a notebook inside of here. Um, I have a pair of scissors, but I love my things. What drew me to picking up this bag? Because this is just a bag where you, you know, you dump stuff in it when you are, you know, you can take this to the grocery store, whatever. Um, it was pink. It was cute. It was in Burlington. And 
I was like, okay, I'm going to put my other little things inside of the bag. When I go into the grocery store, when I go wherever, um, I'll purchase that for that. Um, I purchased this because she is utterly, utterly adorable. She's giving me Chanel vibes. But, guys, what am I saying and why did I make this video? Do you like, do you love the things that you purchase? Because I do. And in saying that, guys, when I look at some of the things that are coming across YouTube on this platform and you have all type of different YouTubers and they're talking about getting rid of the things, honey. They are talking about um, a more minuscule way of having things like, I don't want all of the hype. Now, it is definitely a teacher's own scenario, guys. We all can do what is appeasing and appealing to our own taste without a doubt but when i tell you there is no way that i have worked and gathered my thoughts and my ideas and my finances to create things that i that i want Finally, I get there and I do it or whatever the situation is. And then I'm going to wake up one morning and have an epiphany talking about I don't like my stuff. Why? I don't want my stuff. Um, It no longer speaks to me. It doesn't bring me any joy. Like, come on. Who, what? We, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. And, my, and guys, another thing is I'm so here for... I wish a lot of these people would be more transparent. I feel like when you're able to, you know, come into your space and you've had a space for a little while, for a little while, maybe a few months or a few years, and you're like, okay, I want to refresh. I want to change. That's different. That is something different. When you want to change the color, you want to, you know, move your winter clothes out because now it's spring and it's summer and you're going to move your winter things and put them away and bring out the the clothes for this season that's one thing but when you tell me you're going to get rid of all of your things honey you're going to get rid of all the things they no longer serve you any type of purpose i'm like no stop playing with me because truth you can only do those type of things when you are jumping on waves and trends and you did not purchase things and you ha and you have brand deals and sponsorships that are really sponsoring what you're getting ready to do or you have, you know, a heavy following and because you have a heavy following you know you're making a decent you're making a good amount of money every month from YouTube so then you're like okay and then we're going to pull all of these different brands in we're going to pull these sponsors in when we make this different content so yeah I can come in here and bust this out if I got such and such deals in the works but for all of us regular normal folks right come on now somebody for all of us regular normal folks when you sit down and you're looking at all these different videos and you want to get ideas about your space and you want your space to be a certain way, baby, you got to save up. And you cannot tell me you're going to wake up and be like, baby, I don't like that no more. <laughs> what? I love my things. And guys, I want to express this. This is absolutely positively okay. And it is normal. It's normal. Whatever you have acquired in a mask, you like that. You like it. You like the color of it. You like, you know, having it in your arsenal. You like coming and looking at your things. Like, come on. All right. So, guys, leave in the comments what you think. How do you really like your items that you have for yourself? Whether you have an abundance of things or or whether you have a few things. Do you really like or love your things? I would love to know so we can further expand upon this in the comment section, guys. Okay. 
Until the next time, bye for now.